everybody, welcome to today's show. I apologize to all of you with all the technical difficulty we've had this week. Um, they had fires in the area and it affected everything. Um, we were really fortunate that it didn't come this far. It was about 20 minutes away from us. Anyway, we're going to do the top 10 countdown. <laughs> and I'm going to first present to you a group that is called Like Elephants. And they're an Austrian indie pop band formed in 2014 by Victor Koch, lead vocals, guitar, Martin Wuer, guitar vocals, Roland Gugerbauer, bass, or bass, I should say, Christian Luger, drums, and Manuel Hauer, synthesizer. I really love the synthesizer. Now, their musical style can be described as dreamy indie pop with atmospheric sound influenced by 80s new wave, post-punk, and contemporary dream pop band. From their new EP, we are going to present to you today a song that is called In Between Dreams and Truth, and it is from their album that is called Between Dreams and Truths.
ended just with a strum. And tell you the truth, if I had to classify their music, I would kind of call it dreamy rock music. And that was like elephants. Okay, number nine position. Well, as impressive on stage as on record, British-based Firewood Island had been busy sharpening their live chops. Having headlined the Richer Unsigned Showcase, forget this, Q Magazine, as well as playing in many notable venues. There are just too many to list. They have quite a following with their unique creative sound. So we're going to bring you today from Firewood Island, a song that is called Dearest Brother. Running on broken lines, though you're not a feather. You're giving yourself away, you're an open letter. In someone else's case, I probably wouldn't bother. You are who you are, the dearest brother, the dearest brother, the dearest brother. instrumentals and uh, nuances that they put into that song. It was just wonderful. So I hope we hear more from Firewood Island. Fantastic band. Okay, next in our number eight spot, we have Blue Helix. Now they hail from Washington State. And though they clearly are influenced heavily by the great bands that have come out of the Northwest, they are not stuck in 1994, no way. They do a great job of grabbing little bits and pieces of grunge, mixing it with alternative rock, 
and arena sized power ballads and you'll see that as you hear this next song and I, I tell you this year has been a real monster for the band and they're really getting known so I hope that you will enjoy this as we play Aliens from Blue Helix
I mean, that's the kind of grunge I could fall in love with. Blue Helix. Check him out. Next number seven spot, we have John C. Butler. Now, John is J-O-N, in case you want to look him up. And he's a writer and singer from Leicester, England. And he first came to attention with the classic album that is called Shakespeare, Alabama. Yeah. And that was by Diesel Park West at the dawn of the 90s. Butler is acknowledged as being a writer who has always spurred his own path delivering songs that seem willfully not to pander to the norm and yet display an easy charm and clarity. Well, we're going to let you make your own judgment on that one as we play for you when the walls went down. So long ago now it feels like history We had Wilson here But they had LBJ A moment in time lost under decades of cynicism and pointless greed But there was a time When the walls went down And we were warm When the walls went down Never knew what to make of the 80s, 90s, not just now it all seems back to front But there was a time when the walls went down And we were warm when the walls went down And we talking about and so many people all they know about it is what they read in uh, history books and what they see on TV and 
it was not that at all. What it was, for the most part, was a time when young people, as I see them doing today, decided they had had enough, enough, enough of the material world, and uh, they decided to make it simple. They wore t-shirts and blue jeans that were so cheap. You could buy blue jeans for $2, $5, t-shirts, a dollar. And that is why they started wearing them. Of course, the uh, <laughs> the companies decided that they had to make money on that. And now look how much everything costs. But um, there was a time of unity when the walls went down. And I'm hoping that we can get that again today because... Gosh, folks, um, I have to tell you, I, I don't want to get too political, but we can't allow what's happening in the country and the world to happen. We have to care about each other. That's all I can say about that. So I hope you check him out. Um, when the Walls Went Down by John C. Butler. Now we're moving on to our number six song, and this is from R.J. Comer. And now, he was originally from Chicago, and he started out singing in church with his mom and around the campfire with his dad and grandpa, but he ended up in a lot of bad places at wrong times. Now, he lives in rural Tennessee. He's a storyteller with the backwaters of Americana and blues running through his veins, writing songs that reflect the witty, gritty, tender, and tough guy he is. And I love that description of him, R.J. Comer. Today we give you, I Wasn't Born an Angel. That I was born But they say I didn't cry Something told me To be forewarned And always have an alibi I wasn't born an angel And could be there ain't no such thing
ending on that song. Who was born an angel? I don't think any of us were. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh gosh, she's great though, isn't he? R.J. Comer, or Comer, it's C-O-M-E-R. Now, our next guest, gosh, we just had an interview with him, and it was great. If you want to hear some great stories, I want you to check it out. It's on our It Matters Radio musical guest interview, and his name is Bruce Mississippi Johnson. His baritone voice is velvet to the ears, and it resounds in its own unique style of blues, jazz, and soul. At number five in our lineup today, we are proud to present to you his song called No Good. crush has got the best of me now I'm hanging by my teeth from a tree she took what I had I played my love blind I took all of the reason out of the rhyme why did I go and throw it all Too much damn confusion I'm just no good, no good, no good For nobody but myself For nobody but myself I told her that my life was real tough at the time She told me that she only Wanted to explore these arms of mine As we danced by the fire Sip crystal as I told her about my life Told her about my children Even told her about my wife Why did I go And throw it all away damn confusion I'm just no good, no good, no good for nobody but myself for nobody but myself Break it down, I gotta rap to him, y'all You see, we've been kicking it for about six months and Things were really getting out of hand. I was coming home late and running out of excuses. And she'd been waiting patiently for me to leave my wife. And I'd been stalling, trying to have the best of both worlds. So one night, after work, we were having dinner on the other side of town. And I could see that she had something she wanted to say to me. But the words she could not find. And just as she began to mumbled me the words that she'd found somebody else and that it was over. Out the corner of my eyes, I saw my wife walking through the door. I was busted and left with the bill. Why did I go For nobody but myself 
doesn't he bring life <laughs> to music? I mean, how many of you don't know somebody who has been in that position? And, uh, heck, if you know anybody that's even thinking about it, have <laughs> listen to this video, or to watch the video, I should say, and listen to the music. <laughs> Bruce Mississippi Johnson, great, great, great. I hope that type of music comes back. I love it. And I was starting to, actually. But you just can't find too many baritones like him. All right, our next guest. First of all, I want to tell you something. It Matters Radio has a special, special broadcast that is exclusive to Rise Up TV Patreons. And I'm going to tell you why real fast. Because for a dollar a month, come on, a dollar a month, you can become a patron. And what that does is it helps artists go on tour, pay for hotel rooms, airfare, um, studio time, anything that goes along with the creating of music. And they are all indie artists. And they would love if you would support them. So go to Patreon Rise Up TV and become a patron for them. And you'll get to see the shows that It Matters Radio is producing just for the artists. And only you will get to see them and hear them. Because believe me, the song I'm going to play for you right now is not a song that's going to be on that show. But I did want to introduce you to one of their artists, and the name is Anna Lees. It's A-N-N-L-I-E-S-C. Now, their music encompasses slow tempos, melodic guitar passages, beautiful vocal harmonies, fast tempos, heavy riffs, and a little bit of indie rock thrown in there for good measure. Each musician brings their own style to the band and their own personal taste, and it is evident. You can't put these folks into a box. Now, regardless of how you label them, you can be sure there is something for everybody in their repertoire, and that's hard to do. So in our number four pick for the week, here is a song by Annalise called Stand On My Own.
to you some wonderful, 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 wonderful more music from Mr. Jerry Hall. Well, you know, Jerry seems to make it into our top 10 a lot, but I'm going to tell you why. He is a music composing maniac. I mean, he cranks up hundreds of songs and so fast it's difficult for me to even to keep up with the latest release. What amazes us is they are all excellent. So from his latest EP, which is called Celebrate in the Sunshine, we are going to bring you a song that is called No One Little Girl in our number three spot. Okay, let me tell you about it. I met this woman down in New Orleans. She was the prettiest damn woman that I ever did see. Such a Mississippi queen in a top blue jeans. Yeah. So I swing to paddle boat, promenade rock and roll, staring into my eyes. She really shook my soul. This is the soul. some music and I hope you'll check him out um stop by his website or say hi to him on Facebook along with all the artists that we have on today I know they will all really appreciate it number two spot here we go don't if you have not heard of Wiley Bo Walker you need to because um well he puts on the best shows and he's from Glasgow Scotland 
And he also works across many styles and genres, but maintains a style that really is all his own when it comes down to it. Now, in 2017, Wiley Bo has been working on a new trilogy of albums, and they're based upon tales, stories, and drunken fables taken from his one-man blue swamp and stomp show. It's called Welcome to Voodooville. Yet unreleased, you are going to be one of the first people to listen to this next song of his. And it is called Running Wild. <laughs>
Skywalker, yeah. <laughs> okay. Robert Gregory Brown. And I don't know that many of you have heard of Robert Gregory Brown unless you read books or go to plays. But I'm going to tell you a little bit about Robert. He's an Ampest Nicole award-winning screenwriter and ITW Thriller Award-nominated novelist, publisher, playwright, composer, lyricist, designer, and he says, rabid sample library enthusiast. <laughs> His novels, Trial Junkies and Trial Junkies Negligence, were both Amazon bestsellers. And his first novel, Kiss Her Goodbye, you might have heard that name. It might sound familiar because it was produced by CBS Television. You may have seen Robert when we interviewed him, as well as Beth Verdusky about their musical Cradle Song on our Walking on the Ween interview. Now, this song that we are presenting today had to be number one for it was written for and dedicated to all who lost a loved one in the recent catastrophes that we have had here in the U.S. Um, and one thing I want to say about Robert, he is extremely talented and he is extremely humble. I can't stress that enough. He's a wonderful, wonderful human being. And I hope that all of you will share this song with others because it was written with love. And I hope we all send our love and prayers to the families who were left behind. We bring you from Robert Gregory Brown, our number one song, Prayer for the Fallen. Here's my prayer for the fallen. Here's my song to the gods Send them home to the meadow Don't leave anyone behind face of a sorrow How can we ever be happy again Where will we be the day after tomorrow we'll Take all the time that we need and we'll rise above our pain Once again
once again. Here's my prayer for the fallen. Yeah, beautiful, isn't it? And that was pure vocals and acoustic guitar. Doesn't get better than that. Well, folks, we will be back tomorrow with our Friday music mix-up. And for today, please do something kind for another person. Show a little bit of love because we sure need it in the world. And as always, you just keep on rocking on. Bye-bye. Oh,